Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can add a new sound profile with Adapt Sound on the Samsung Galaxy S23 series. First up on the home button to return back to the home screen. And from the home screen, swipe down at the top and tap on the settings icon. Next, we scroll down and tap on sounds and vibration. Then we scroll down to the bottom and tap on sound quality and effects. Next, tap on adapt sound. Now scroll down and tap on test my hearing. And then make sure you plug in your headphone or your earbuds and tap on the start button. So, so here, put on your headphone and close all multimedia apps. Okay, so I'm going to put on the headphone or the earbuds right here. And then you can tap on the start button. So we're just going to wait for my earbuds to connect first. Okay, after it's connected, we can now start. And then it will go through a series of tests. It will ask you whether you can hear the beep or not. So you just tap on yes or no. So say listen carefully. And if you can hear the beep, just tap on yes. And you can you continue to do this until the whole thing finished. So I'm just going to tap on yes for now. But if you don't hear anything, you can tap on no. When you tap on no, then the phone will increase or boost the frequency of the sound to make it louder. And here it choose whether you prefer. Uh, you set a preferred ear for calls, so you can set a on the left hand side or the right hand side. And if you usually uh, listen to your phone call on the left, then you select left. And then you go down in here, you can give the profile a name. So you can give a, a name or you can use the default name. You can also tap on setup again to redo your test. Otherwise, tap on the save button. And if you scroll down, you can see we have now created a new sound profile. You can tap on the settings icon on the right hand side to go back in here and make the change. You can tap on set again to restart the test. Or you can simply delete the profile by tapping on the delete button at the top to delete a sound profile. And that's it. Finally, you can tap on the home button to return back to the home screen. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.